Sister Apollot Mary Goretti, the head teacher of St. Clair Girls School, has done a commendable job towards restoring the glory of the school that had almost been written off. When she joined St. Clair in 2011, the school had accumulated a huge debt on electricity and unpaid staff allowances. Enrollment had plummeted to an all-time low and parents had lost trust in the school. When posted to the school, Sister Apollot did not resign to fate but initiated cost-cutting measures to bring back the school on track. She installed a solar system to replace the use of grid electricity whose bills had become unmanageable a poultry project and a banana plantation to supplement the people's diet and to improve the teachers' welfare. There were a number of issues in the school. I had to combine effort with the staff members whom I found on the ground and then eventually we lobbied for some support from the stakeholders. We got funds and we renovated that classroom block. Through school fees and other projects, we have been able to to install solar system in the school to supplement the lighting system because Umeme is unreliable. Now we have our good feeding. The staff members have diet. The girls also have diet. We have a poultry farm. We have planted bananas. We have fruits like oranges. Occasionally, the girls eat these fruits and the, the staff members. She gave attention to the development of skills like knitting, embroidery and farming with the aim of making her pupils not only meet their immediate school needs but also become self-reliant in future. This is to help girls besides academics to have skills training. So they make handwork, they make decorations, they make tablecloths and they, we sell them and we boost on our income. The nun also started a savings club and a girl child education movement. This school is an inclusive school. We have children with special needs. So when they sell these products, that money is shared among the most needy. We look out and get a girl who is desperate. Then we see how best to support that girl. Sister Apollot runs the school in the principles of prayer, respect and love of one another. She asserts that teaching is a biblical calling which every teacher should be proud of.